Hello learners, welcome to our virtual learning class. Today we have integrated science and we are going to talk about personal hygiene. Personal hygiene. But before then, let's look at what hygiene is. Okay? So we say hygiene is what the art of what? taking good care of ourselves and the environment, okay, to prevent the spread of what? diseases. Okay? Well, we are taking good care of ourselves and the environment or our surroundings just to prevent the spread of diseases, okay? It's all hygiene, okay? Good. Now let's look at personal hygiene. Personal hygiene is all the art of what? Cleaning and taking good care of our bodies, okay? When we clean and take good care of our bodies, it's what we refer to as all personal hygiene. So in personal hygiene, we have to do what? Clean ourselves, we have to be neat, and we have to take what? Good care of ourselves. When we are doing that, we are practicing what personal hygiene. We are talking about your, your, yourself, your person, personal, okay? So when you are taking good care of yourself, making sure that you are always clean, you are trying to prevent or the spread of disease, and it's what we call personal hygiene, okay? Very good. Now let's look at some ways of maintaining what? Personal hygiene. We want to say what? Washing what? Hand what? Washing or washing of our hand, okay? Good. We should always wash our hands to keep our hands on a neat or clean, okay? Because when we want to eat, we is our hand that we use to hold, feed ourselves. So when our hands are dirty, we feed into our body hot germs, and that will cause us or that will spread what disease. Meanwhile, we are trying to prevent or the spread of what disease, okay? Now let's look at how or the time we can wash our hands. Example: When we visit or the the washroom, okay? After visiting the washroom. We have to do what? Wash our hands with what? Soap, especially under hot, running water. Okay? After removing the diaper from our, our maybe our sister or our brother, we should we should what? Wash our hands. Very good. Then number two says your dental care. Dental care. Very good. When we talk of dental care, we are talking about how we take good care of what? Our teeth. Okay? Taking good care of our teeth. You see, some of us we don't take good care of what of our teeth, you see. So at the time when we when we are speaking to our friends, we, our mouth do what smell, okay. When we wake up, we don't eat, some, at some time we don't even brush our teeth. Then we, we eat, okay. After eating the food, you see that you not you not feel well. You have problem with your heart, your stomach. What is happening? Like that you are spreading a disease, okay. Meanwhile, we are trying to prevent all uh, diseases or the spread of diseases, okay. So we have to do what take good care of what, our teeth by heart. Brushing our teeth regularly, okay, at least twice a day. When you wake up early in the morning and evening, when you are going to do sleep to keep your, your, your teeth hot neat. Then number point three, you say so bathing hot regularly. Bathing regularly. Okay? We are talking about how to take good care of ourselves. So when we don't bath, it means we will still be hot, dirty. Okay? So we have to bath regularly to keep ourselves or our body clean. Okay, so that will not smell. Good. Then I'm point four says on using clean hot clothes. Using clean hot clothes. Okay, good. At time, especially with the boys, after playing football, we don't wash our our hot jerseys. We just keep them like that. The next time we are going to play, then we wear it again. So in case that jersey comes into contact with a gem, when we wear it again, we are going to do what? Spread that hot sickness okay so we have to keep our clothes on clean we wash them regularly after using them then we iron them okay we dry them very well and iron them keep them at all and clean dry up please very good then we have what cutting of our fingernails okay we have to cut our fingernails regularly once it's hot it it grooms okay very good then we have what trimming of hair okay we have to trim our hair regularly, okay? We have to trim our hair or cut our hair, okay? Trim it to the, the nice or level, to a nice level or acceptable or level, okay? Good. Then we also have our sweeping our rooms regularly. When we are talking about personal hygiene, we are talking about how to keep everything, our, our surrounding and ourselves clean, okay? So when we, are wearing, when we are wearing neat dresses and our room is hot, that is, so there will be spread of what 
diseases. Okay, so as we are keeping ourselves clean, we have to keep our hot rooms too hot clean. We have to work and we have to clean the room always when the room is dirty. We have to keep them hot clean. Very good. Then the next thing is what having a healthy diet. Having what a healthy diet. Okay, for us to prevent the spread of diseases, we have to eat what a good food. Okay. Food from a good source, not from no, not food that has been contaminated. So when we eat food that has been contaminated, or food that is not good, food that's poor, we will not have a, a good heart health. Okay, that's why at time after eating those kind of food, you feel that you feel like vomiting, and maybe you feel stomach hot pains because the food is not hot, healthy for you. Okay, and then at times too, so oily food too are not hot, healthy for us. Okay, very good. Oily food are not healthy for us, so we should limit the, the level of our oil food intake. Okay, good. Then the last one here is what? sweeping our hot classrooms. Sweeping our classrooms. Okay, when we are keeping our surrounding ourselves clean too, our classroom too, we have to do what? Keep them neat. Okay, we have to sweep them. We keep them neat after drinking pure water. We, we dump the, the sachet into what? That's being after tearing. Your, 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 your exercise book too, you have to fold it to work and dump it into what? The dustbin. That will keep our classrooms all clean, okay? So when we are doing all these things, we are practicing what? Good personal health hygiene, okay? And we have to know that when we are talking about personal hygiene, we are trying to keep ourselves and our surroundings clean to prevent the spread of what? Diseases, okay? So when we don't practice personal hygiene, what are we trying to do? We are trying to do what? Spread all diseases. Okay, and we, since we don't want to fall sick, we want, we want to be healthy always so that we can come to school and learn. We have to do more practice or personal hygiene to keep ourselves all clean and healthy. Okay, very good. I hope I'll bring up with this, I'll bring our lesson for today to an end. And until we meet again, have a nice day. Bye.